I'm Eli Egbert, and welcome to the second episode of a series where I dissect the meaning of national flags and coat of arms. This time I will be doing Estonia. Let's get into it. Okay, so the flag this time is fiendishly simple, so after I take a whole two seconds to describe its meaning, I'll get into the other flags that Estonia has had and the history thereof. So, the officially recognized flag of Estonia's proportions are 7 by 11. It is a horizontal tricolor of, from top to bottom, blue, black, and white. This was believed to be inspired by the colors from the Finnish flag because, as we all know, Estonia loves the Finns and the tricolor of France's flag. The blue is for the sky, the black is for the soil and the fate of the Estonian people, and the white is for purity, hard work, and commitment. They also have this variant flag, which is a blue, black, and white swallowtail with the coat of arms in the middle left. This variant flag is curiously 713 proportions, unlike the other flag. The flag was adopted on the 21st of November 1918, and later readopted. more on that later, on the 7th of August 1990. Side note, they also have this awful naval jack, which just looks like a rip off of the Union Jack of the UK's naval ensign. Another side note, all Baltic nations have a naval jack like this, actually, that just look ripped off from the UK. I actually kind of like the one for Latvia, though, but the one for Estonia is just plain lazy. I mean, the one for Lithuania is, wait, is this even an actual flag? I mean, who designed this thing? I mean, come on, Lithuania, even Latvia ripped off the UK and still made it look good. Ugh, sorry for getting off track. Okay, the history of the current flag. So Estonia and the Baltics in general were, as we all know, one of the last places for Christianity to spread into Europe. So when they did, they just used a German order of the cross because they were lazy, which is literally just a black cross on a white field. Later, they put a patch of blue in the top left and bottom right, this representing the Virgin Mary. Later, they had a white over blue flag, which totally isn't ripped off of the San Marinian flag. And then finally, on the 21st of November 1918, the current flag was adopted. There is some debate to change it to a Nordic cross like this, or this, or this, of which I would support just for the consistency or the Christian symbolism. So about the readoption thing, basically the Sparknotes edition of what happened is they got independence from Russia being a government before that, for a few decades, but then knock knock who's that, it's the Soviet Union, and made them go back to having this flag until the 90s, which looks strangely similar to Kiribati's flag until they went back to their original. They also had this flag, which was used during the Estonian government with the Russian Empire from 1721 to 1971, when they got their first independence. Sorry, but another side note, a small part of the Livonian government bled over into what is now the day's Estonia, so I thought I should include it as well. Okay, now for the coat of arms. The coat of arms of Estonia was adopted on the 19th of June, 1925, and not unlike the current flag, was readopted on the 6th of April, 1993. It consists of a golden shield with the golden oak branches around it. Keep in mind, these golden oak branches are sometimes emitted, and three left-facing blue lines inside of the shield. The coat of arms is inspired by the coat of arms of Denmark, which ruled in the northern part of what is now Estonia back in the 1200s. Keep in mind, they have an alternate, but not yet official coat of arms. This coat of arms in the Soviet years, and a, Soviet, and a coat of arms used similar to the current one with the exception of a crown on top, used during the Russian government years. 